the notebook. That was nuts. Wasn't you disappointed at Fallout 76? I was. Uh, there just wasn't enough content for me to keep playing it. I really liked the building in it. Like building your house and shit. That was great. That was super fun. Um, everything else fucking sucked. It was just, I really lost all interest in that game. There was just nothing to do. I hear they've added a shit more, which is awesome. I don't know if they can bring me back with that, but maybe, I don't know. All right. Hi, Jenny. How are you? I've never played Outer Worlds. I still have to play that. I know. And that wasn't that Zeke's like game of the year. I take notes like that in my journal, but it's usually like notes about why are you feeling this way? Why does your brain feel like shit? Let's figure that out together. Okay, what was I doing? Let's go this way. Is it? I really want to play it. Yeah, it's in my backlog for sure. Zeke told me it was his game of the year, or whatever year. Not la Was it last year? I don't remember. That's the thing. They should stay. Some bugs were still there from Fallout 4, and they almost got in trouble for no discounts at first. I mean, the game, like... It was still a piece of shit, and they were trying to add, like, a buy stuff store. I just can't. I cannot with... I can't. I just have nothing. I have nothing. They're insane. They're all crazy. Oh, I'm sure I would. Zeke's told me all about it. I need to play it. I have so many games I need to play. But I'm kind of... I'm kind of just enjoying like just going through games like when we kind of get bored being like all right let's pick a new game let's try stellaris fuck it let's try this one i'm kind of really digging that we're just kind of like dipping into a lot of different games it's fun construction project concluded oh <gasps> he's doing an after show discussing the game he got to play four hours oh i know jesse i got to do a role play with him one time that's my one claim to fame i role played with jesse cox he was a turtle and i was a kenku and I think I made him laugh once, which I was very excited about. But he probably has no fucking idea who I am. <laughs> the turtle, do you remember that? He was like, hmm. He was like this old turtle that just kind of went along with everything. He was great. He was so funny. He, it, I mean, from what I, from what I worked with him, he's hilarious and very down to earth and normal. It is impossible to do everything. So I just kind of like, if the mood strikes me, I do something. And if I'm enjoying something, I don't push myself to do something else. Skilled Killer, what's up? Oh, oh, Skilled Killer. Thank you for watching the ads. I, I try, I have the literally the least amount of ads you can possibly have on your stream. That's what I have. They play them no matter what, unfortunately. Was he a history teacher? I didn't know that. Did you know that um, the guy from Epic Food, Epic Food Time, uh, Charlie Mortensen or whatever, he was a history teacher. Interesting. I stink. Can I build anything yet? No. Maybe. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for the classy live and giving an anus. It's <gasps> Uneven Steven! Thank you so much for gifting a subscription to my chat. Skilled Killer! Skilled Killer. Use a butt was the highest order. I was almost going to call you Unskilled Killer because Uneven Steven. I'm an idiot. Your butt was the highest order. I challenge you to go forth and be consensual. Thank you for being awesome and being here. Epic food. I know. Oh, you're new for Mixer. Oh my God. Welcome to Twitch. I'm so sorry that uh, what happened to Mixer happened. That was some fucked up shit. I feel very bad. I know a lot of streamers around Mixer and I've been trying to welcome all of them, help them rebuild. It's just a shit show, man. I'm so sorry. Yeah, Helen is from uh, Mixer. A couple other people are here from Mixer. It's just, yeah, welcome welcome back to Twitch. We're here to help. I'll help you. Like I, I can, The best I can do is raid people, shout them out and follow them. Uh, they literally just closed code, like just. They were like, Facebook gaming is taking over or whatever, but Facebook gaming is basically making you apply if you were a partner. 
and then they'll decide whether or not they'll give you partnership or something. Yeah, we welcome Mixer community. If anybody gives you a bad time, just leave them. We don't like them either. Don't worry. Nobody likes them. It's fine. We like you. I love you. It's fine. Facebook gaming is terrible. I wouldn't go there. We were talking about that because some people were trying to be pissy yesterday. Like, oh, it's going to be just unnecessary uh, competition for us. If you find another streamer competition, you need to look inside yourself and your, your own content, motherfucker. People don't. That's not how it works. But I was saying, like, what the fuck would happen if Twitch was pulled out from under my feet? Facebook gaming? <laughs> I'd be fucked. We have to have sympathy and empathy. It's fucking fucked what happened. It's disgusting. It's terrifying. <laughs> Anybody with a heart and a soul knows that's ridiculous and you have to. I mean, we're all fucking streamers at the end of the day. You know what I mean? Like, we all do the exact same thing. We all make the exact same content. And no one else is looking out for us. As we've learned recently. So we got to fucking watch out for ourselves. In my opinion. That's just how I run my shit. No pressure. I used to love college humor. Yeah. They screwed so many people because they couldn't handle the bad publicity, etc. I mean, I'm sure you've seen what's in the Twitch papers lately. Like, we don't have good publicity either. But I think we just, we have the, we have the, we have the numbers. I think we have enough people to make a difference, you know? Like, I saw some, like, you, did you guys see Avery? Like, I saw some very prolifically large streamers on the front page yesterday after I was crying, talking about being assaulted and raped. And it was just like, like, how could Twitch watch all those girls that work for them, under them, and our fantastic people talk about stuff like that and not do something? Like, but we have like all those people and, and there's a lot of people on Twitch with huge audiences. Uh, remarkable. Um, what do we want? Survey speed, anomaly, discovery, archeology, span excavation. I want survey speed, hell yeah. Let's do this, bitch. Um, let's go over here. Is this all this game is? What do you mean? No, oh God, no a really long game like it does it's not a fast game you aren't gonna finish this in one day you know what i mean a scientist is what i need okay i don't have that yet this is how you set up the game have you ever played a 4x game most of them start out ridiculously slow because you have to like set up your world basically um, we're hive mind, so this is good. It is, Laws. It is. Once you get to year 2280, you end up with so many plates, you have to pause to stay sane. Oh, I'm so excited. I agree. They could have done anything but sh just fucking shut it down. Like... It's Microsoft. Like that's the situation the, log updated. That's the insane part to me. It's not like some Did little you know? company that went under. It's Microsoft. And it's literally just it feels like now I'm on the outside looking in obviously. It feels like to me they just gave up. No, I haven't Killian. No. Yeah, it just feels like someone went, "Man, I'm kind of bored. I'm bored with my project. Let's just whatever." Well, like Facebook or something. That's what it felt like to us, like when we all saw it. The Twitch community bled for you guys. Like, I don't know if you guys System saw that. Survey concluded. It was horrible. I heard about it when I was live. Um, we were watching the front page of Mixer, pe girls just busting into tears. It was fucking horrible. Nightmarish. Everybody's worst fucking nightmare, you know? I kind of went over that story a little bit about someone referring to partners as slaves. Just wild. Construction wild. project concluded. Wild. I can't believe they sent an email out to the partners after. Uh, yeah, that's just. All of it's poopy and makes me feel icky. 
and I'm not saying Twitch. Twitch is so far from perfect. Like, Twitch is so far from perfect. I probably couldn't fly there right now because of Corona. But damn, damn. They had a female, the head female manager said partners of Mixer were her slaves and she's their slave owner. <sighs> Sorry, I blacked out. Fuck happened. Wow. Cool. People are, wow. Cool. Yeah. Nice. Awesome. Gross. <laughs> Big yikes forever. Yikes forever. <laughs> Maybe they just fired her and no one wanted to take over. God. The things that people think are funny. Like, I've said it and I'll say it again. I wonder what it's like to have zero sense of humor. Like... What does that feel like to be unfunny? I wonder. She's still there. Wow. Okay. Weird. I can't talk. I can't speak on it. I have no, like, who the fuck am I? But wow. That's why Mixer Partners chose to not stream at all for days. Wow. God damn. I mean, there is someone in our community who did come out about a partnerships manager who assaulted her, so we're not any better. I mean, we've got shit too. You just, it's new shit, different day, you know? I guess. I heard they were always gonna sell that brought over talent just to bump up the value, really? I mean, it's insane. I'm not, there's nothing against, I have nothing against Ninja or Shroud. They, I would have taken the money too to go do that. Um, but, uh, they could have invested that money in like Mixer. <laughs> everywhere has shit essentially. It's true. Like there's drama everywhere. You just got to deal with it. Uh, we deal, we dealed with it by all universally talking about rape stories for a day. It's terrible. It was a horrible day yesterday. <laughs> Talking about rape stories and then going right into RP was really weird for my brain. Their income, their livelihood, like I can't. I mean, they could probably, I mean, I don't know. Skilled, same. I'm a full-time streamer. I feel you. I mean, it's Microsoft. They've got the money to throw around if they want to. That makes me even more mad, which means they could have just done that and invested into Mixer and their, I just, it's, it feels like they were cat, it feels like people would catfish. I know people that left Twitch to go to Mixer to try it out and they, I feel like they were catfished into Mixer or something. It feels wrong. Feels weird. You know? Microsoft does have a lot of money to throw around. You are right, Law's name. I just wish they'd throw it at, I don't know. Who knows who's in charge of the gaming unit or department or whatever. I never saw a way to find LGBTQIA plus communities on Mixer, so I didn't really spend much time there. Oh, that's kind of shitty. Plot twist, Katie. That person seems to have admitted everything may have happened. That's because they did. Are you kidding me? Oh, 
it's magic. I can't put captains in these ships yet. We'll get there. Don't worry, guys. Andrew, I'm happy for you, but at the same time, like, internally screaming? We Weird. have found an anomaly. <gasps> an From anomaly! Time time, our science ships will make these discoveries. I know. Yes. What is my galaxy's name? Um, uh, Bikini Bottom, I think. We're going with like a SpongeBob theme because we're we are Gary. It's magic, you know. It's a good song. Had a guy, yeah, a guy had raped a girl from what? From Mixer, and the man was a partner on Mixer. He ended up admitting it. Only showed he was sorry for him and not her. One of my moderators admitted, like, went forth and talked about their abuser, and their abuser attacked them in their tweet. And System said, none concluded. of that was true. This Without is all bullshit. You're system. attacking me. And now, apparently, they're not. I hate people. I had Gary as my pet snail email for years. That makes me happy. We left behind Jackalanus for Bikini Bottom. I see. Sweet. Jackalanus got deleted because my power went out, remember? It was terrible. It's disgusting. Like, you're already a fucking sexual predator. Can you stop attacking the person at least for three seconds, maybe? I don't know. Just a thought. Just me. Who am I, though? Just a streamer. I'm just a girl in the world. And that's all that you'll ever be. It was quite literally sucked into the dark void of no electricity for seven hours. I still don't know what knocked my electricity out, but the whole street was out. My neighbors out here were sitting in their yard complaining about it all day. I was like, bitch, get a book. They were like, all the old people are always making fun of us, but like, we have electricity, we might as well use that. And I was like, mm, just read a book. Stellar Stellaris only on PC has sold 3 million copies. That makes me really happy because the game is amazing. I can't make one yet because I don't have any fucking resources. I need to make construction ships. A construction ship. Um, you're doing that one, so you'll come over here and do this. Guess you won't. I'll get him. I have kind of like a method. I'm still learning, basically. I'm an idiot. Um, ouch. I just scratched my own face. Basically, yes. Was there a loud bang? No. No, but people do set off fireworks here constantly. I know I saw people like trying to start a, a conspiracy theory about fireworks. We've always had fireworks forever. Von Haddon, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for that Twitch Prime sub. You are a butt wizard of the highest order. I challenge you to go forth and be consensual in everything you ever do in your life. Wash your hands. Black Lives Matter. I think it's a cycle that social media perpetuates for things like this. Someone accuses another person in the context of a situation. Other people are like, hey, that's also happened to me in the same scenario with similar people. Then someone else piles in with a somewhat shaky or downright false claim. We never know for sure. And the existence of the false claim makes it easier for actual predators to use the you're lying. And that's this. And I'm. Yes. And it fucking makes me so angry. I talked about that yesterday. Concluded. Construction oh, project God. concluded. <laughs> fucking facts. And those fuck those cheap stories that are shaky make every other story seem oh, insignificant. God. And that's disgusting because no fucking rape story is insignificant. But you bury them in these, my boyfriend cheated on me, kind of. Anomalous readings registered. Like, cheating is evil. You're evil. That's bad. But that's just a bad relationship. You're not a rapist. Dude, I love the fireworks. But I also think about getting fires all the time because of the fireworks. But I do love them. I love fireworks. Fireworks are one of my favorite things in the entire world. And I love that they happen here, like, every fucking night. Yeah, we talked about that yesterday, too. How rape specifically is not about sex um most rapists don't even finish it's about the power it's about removing the power from you and it's horrible oh it's a transformer 
I didn't hear it, but it could have been far away from me. I don't know. Cause that, I mean, the whole fucking neighborhood was out. So it could have been pretty far away from me. I don't know. It's possible. Um, archeological excavation speed. Ooh, mining station Bulldog, sick. Anomaly research speed, let's do this one. My, I've never had an animal that's been anxious around, uh, <clears throat> around, um, fireworks, and I feel very fortunate for that. It's creative to burn the world. Oh my god, wasn't that in, uh, was that Sim Simpsons? The voices tell me to burn everything. Burn them all. Or something like that. Oh god. Scrolling up chat, I missed some chat. All right, Ralph Wiggum. What? So the question I lost my galaxy. There it is. Uh, the question is as a company that makes its money off a of social group such as Twitter or Twitch. What do you do if when your platform is used to put a loudspeaker complete. on alleged behavior that is one of the most difficult crimes to prove in a perfect scenario? No fucking idea. I would not want to be in charge of that. I have no idea. And I hate that I don't know because I wish I could help. I got nothing. It's such a horrible thing. I was talking to Zeke about that and it's horrible to say, but like literally how does a company control that? or prove that or do any I don't know I really I don't know I wish I did I wish I was a smart feller but I'm not yeah yeah what scares me honestly before about the whole thing is false accusations ruining lives that don't, I mean, I don't know. That scares me. People don't take that shit serious enough. That's how my grandfather was with me. I would have to rub his feet before I was allowed to get him a drink. It was his way of grooming me. Luckily it only happened at one, the one time, but it had long lasting effects. Ew. Anomaly. Dude, I didn't even know I was groomed until like two days ago. I had no idea what grooming was. And I was like, oh my God, I've 100% been groomed. It's disgusting. It is seriously like fucking Excuse me while I vomit in my mouth. Oh. oh, Ralph, that's who Ralph Wiggum. Okay, I streamer brain. I already completely forgot what the fuck we were talking about. Because that's what I do. Um, can you build anything? No. Okay. It made me feel disgusting. Like I had this whole internal thing, like am I only successful on Twitch because I was groomed? Am I successful because of this disgusting criminal who's in fucking jail now for being a creepo? And I had to like have a very long talk with myself in my head, like no Katie, it would have, you know, not been, it would have been over, you know, you would have, yeah, I just, it's weird. I hate it. <clears throat> He said he didn't that time, but maybe with other girls. He looks to feel good now, at least. Mike Tyson? Wasn't he convicted of rape? I don't know. The Falcors of the dog world? Oh my god, I used to call Link Falcor all the time. He would flop and all of his feathers would go everywhere and he looked just like Falcor. He was convicted. Yuck. All right, I can finally get something. What do we need? <coughs> the IS Carter crew is excited to report an unanticipated find on the surface of Spica 3. Not only are there plentiful sand dunes on the planet composed of rare metal granulate, the sand itself is almost com almost entirely composed of countless broken nanites. Sick. Yeah. Oh, 
Noble. You know, I, sometimes I forget I got a streamer of the year nomination. That seems so surreal. It doesn't feel like that was me. Like I don't, I'm so small scale, you know? Creepy. Fun fact, Falcor's original German name is Fucher, but have an English speaking person pronounce that. Is it fucker or Fucher? Cause I would have said Fucher. I still don't know why I was nominated. That was very weird. It was a weird time. But I it was fun. I don't know. It was interesting. Um resource Hive Warren. Housing and amenities. Future? Like future? Thanks, guys. I didn't win because I was up against Ninja. I was nominated with Ninja, which is so weird. But like, obviously he won. Rightfully so. He did amazing things for the Twitch community, kind of like inadvertently on accident. Sure. Propulsion. Sounds fun. Situation log updated. I think if one of the logics of your groomer was, I'll teach her how to be a good streamer and then she'll want me. I think that's a safe separation point. You'll have to run some mental exercises to separate the two. Sometimes the conflicting actions of an antagonist in our lives create the levers we need to cope. Yeah, it's hard Anomaly for me. Failed. He groomed me more to be like a weird feeder channel for his feeder, for his channel. And he would make all these creepy clip videos about how much he loved me and how much he did for me. Like how he kind of took responsibility for creating me and he was my father on Twitch. Like it was so weird. And then he got arrested and he's in jail now and I don't know why, but it was so fucking gross. So like, I don't know. It just was weird. But like, he never raided me ever. He didn't do anything to like promote my channel in any way, shape or form. He just would talk to me as a Research successful included. streamer. Yeah, he would like say things like I was in a relationship at the time and he would say things like Twitch is going to take a real toll on your relationship because my my significant other was not in Twitch. Yeah, real out of place things like you just Anomaly. don't say to someone. Yeah. You never say that. You never I would never say that to fucking anybody. What? Your job's gonna take a toll on your relationship. What the fuck? It's terrible. Like a fuck, literally like a fucked up pyramid scheme that he wanted to fuck probably, but like, no, thank you. Um, And it took me until literally two days ago and I was just like, gross. Anomaly found. Twitch father, yeah. Hi, Anis, how are you? I want to call you Anis so bad, but I won't. I know that's not your name. And I'm respectful, sometimes. Yeah, it was disgusting. It was so, it makes me feel so fucking gross. So fucking disgusting in my soul to even think about it. And I had to have a lot of moments with myself where I was like, Katie, you're not successful because of that repo. That is not how the world works. Look at all those uninhabitable planets. Cool. Anus, I just love it because my channel is all about butts. I feel ill. I mean, it was literally like. And he would play these videos on his channel. Like if I came into his channel to say hi in the chat, he'd pull up a video of him talking about how how proud of me he is for being partnered and blah, 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 blah. and it was just like <sighs> it made me so uncomfortable and then for a while like he would write me letters like he stopped streaming and I got letters from him and it was just <clears throat> oh I'm getting shivers thinking about it <clears throat> but I just like I dealt with it blocked him on everything and just deleted everything and then he went to prison and I don't know why um, instead of reporting anything because I didn't even think about it. Like actual letters. Yeah, 